The Sahara, a name synonymous with endless sand dunes, stark landscapes, and a harsh, unforgiving sun. The desert has, for centuries, presented an inhospitable barrier, separating the northern and sub-Saharan regions of Africa. But in recent years, something astonishing has been unfolding in the Algerian Sahara. It has slowly started to turn green. This isn't a mere anomaly nor is it an overnight phenomenon. The greening of Algeria's Sahara has been a gradual process, influenced by a combination of natural and human-induced factors. A remarkable interplay between conservation efforts, climate patterns, and human willpower is progressively altering the canvas of Algeria's portion of the world's largest hot desert. One cannot overlook the implications of climate change when discussing alterations in geographical landscapes. The global shift in climate patterns has induced alterations in rainfall patterns across the Sahara, with some regions experiencing more precipitation than historically typical. Algeria has seen sporadic instances of increased rainfall, leading to temporary yet significant vegetation blooms. But attributing the greening solely to changing environmental conditions would be an oversimplification. The Algerian government, in conjunction with various NGOs, has been actively pursuing reforestation and desert reclamation projects, aimed at halting and potentially reversing desertification within its territories. The Green Dam, or Le Barrage Vert, initiated in the 1970s, is one such monumental initiative. Spanning more than 1,200 kilometers and aimed at curtailing the southward expansion of the Sahara, this project has seen millions of trees planted in an attempt to create a natural barrier against desert encroachment. The greening of the Sahara is not merely an environmental anomaly, it's a testament to resilience and foresight. Villages and nomadic tribes, who've traditionally navigated the harsh conditions of the desert, are witnessing a slow but palpable change in their surroundings. Where once there were barren dunes, now there are pockets of vibrant life, altering not only the physical landscape but also the socio-economic one. The increased vegetation offers new opportunities and challenges for indigenous communities. For generations, the desert tribes have adapted their lifestyles to navigate the harsh, arid terrain. Now, the emergence of greener landscapes introduces alternative agricultural possibilities, potentially shifting traditional nomadic lifestyles toward more settled agrarian ones. Furthermore, the greening of the Sahara may have profound implications for regional biodiversity. The emergence of vegetative patches provides new habitats and food sources for various fauna, enabling the establishment and expansion of ecosystems within areas that were previously devoid of substantial life. Yet, challenges abound in this transformative journey. The spread of vegetation is not uniform and can, in instances, exacerbate resource inequalities between communities. Some regions benefit from the emergence of new agricultural lands, while others witness no significant change, deepening disparities in wealth, resource access, and societal stability. Beyond local impacts, the greening phenomenon raises questions about Algeria's position on the global stage. As nations worldwide grapple with the consequences of climate change, Algeria's experiences offer invaluable insights into managing and potentially leveraging environmental transitions for national benefit. The strategic approach towards this transformation can serve as a blueprint for other nations facing similar environmental shifts. Ensuring that the alteration of the physical landscape translates into sustainable development and improved living conditions for all citizens remains a complex yet vital objective. Moreover, the stability of the region amidst these changes must be thoroughly considered. As communities transition from traditional nomadic lifestyles to more settled agricultural ones, managing and mitigating potential socio-cultural conflicts and identity crises will be paramount. It is imperative to recognize that while the greening Sahara brings forth opportunities, it is also rife with challenges that extend beyond mere environmental considerations. Strategic resource management, socio-economic planning, and ensuring equitable access to emerging resources are pivotal to harnessing the benefits of this ecological transformation. As new ecosystems develop amidst the sand dunes, a delicate balance must be struck between conserving burgeoning biodiversity and harnessing new agricultural lands for human use. Herein lies a paradox. The emergence of new life brings hope, it also demands judicious use to prevent inadvertent destruction. Furthermore, considering global perspectives, Algeria's greening desert provides a unique research avenue to understand the impacts of climate change on arid ecosystems. Scientists and researchers are keenly observing these transitions, deciphering data, and unfolding the mystery of environmental resilience and adaptability. It is vital to ponder, what can the world learn from Algeria's experiences? The greening Sahara is not merely a local or national phenomenon. 
It embodies the universal tale of change, adaptation, and the perpetual dynamism of our planet. The intertwined narratives of humans and nature, navigating through the complexities of change, forge a story that transcends borders. Algeria's greening desert is not merely an environmental episode, it's a chapter in the collective human experience, delineating our intrinsic connection with the earth beneath our feet. It beckons a reflection upon our interactions with our environment, a call to navigate through impending global transitions with foresight, planning, and an empathetic understanding of the myriad lives, human and non-human, that inhabit our shared spaces. Thus, Algeria's Sahara tells a tale of metamorphosis, of sands turning into gardens, and of a future that's perpetually being reshaped by the dynamic interplay between the Earth and its inhabitants. It tells a story not of isolated change, but of a global system intricately connected and perpetually in flux. In concluding thoughts, one might say the sands of the Sahara are whispering tales of yesterdays and tomorrows, intertwining histories and futures, and casting shadows of challenges and opportunities alike. Algeria stands amidst these shifting sands, navigating through the dunes of change, crafting a future that acknowledges both the trials and triumphs brought forth by the greening desert. Thanks for watching Middle East Info. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe.